Here, um, I'm not good with these. You dropped it down there. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay, let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent III. Industrial... Mead? Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. I'm sorry. So, no ideas then. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. Whoa, Lee, you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna have to just... Get up! Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. What did that mean? She's at the hotel. Where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our... urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. We have to go now. Like right this goddamn minute. Where, Lee? Come on. We're trapped. How long you think we have? What? I... I don't know. You should've cut it off. At least then there would've been a chance. Well, you didn't. And it's too late now. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me! We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. Ah! You ruined that dude's face. Shut up, sweetie. Look! It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. This wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. I wasn't gonna hurt you. Sure, pal. I know. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well... We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. If you were me, you'd be a foot taller. Hey! And about 50 pounds heavier. 
You, uh, wouldn't get scared as much. With your arm and my leg, I'll cripple fight you right here, buddy. I would have had to chop this one off for you to even stand a chance. Wish you would have taken it off. Don't think it matters much now. I'm losing a lot of feeling in it. Really? Yeah, it's hot, like when you break a bone. But tingly, like it's asleep. So when we get this guy, what do you think? Make sure he never takes anybody from anyone again. World's got enough on the planet. And, you know, whatever happens to you, uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I'm bitten, Krista. We all know that's a wrap. There's gotta be something. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not doing this right now. Krista, listen to him. It's what I want, okay? What about him? We gotta support him. He's only a kid still. It's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? No, that was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. The kid killed his family, so there's been some tension there. Really? What happened? Kenny's son got bitten during a raid by some gang that Ben was secretly helping. They used him. Kenny's wife died because of their son. Jesus. Well, seems like it got through to Kenny. Whatever that's good for. All right. I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just... fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. It'll be alright, kid. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Maybe take it easy on him from here on out. I'm angry as hell. Not at him. Maybe. Maybe not. You heard him outside. I did. I never really thought about it that way. This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. I'm sorry for hurting you in any way, Kenny. It's impossible to go through life without causing some sort of pain. But sometimes I can't help but wonder if I could have lost a little fast. Me and me both, Doc. Well, cheers. I'm through! No walkers. Things are looking up. 